Hello, this is Dr. Gay from First Lake MRI, and this is a case of Hoffa disease or inflammation within Hoffa's fat pad. And this was a runner. They had gone out and overdid it a little bit, and they had knee pain and swelling and came in for their MRI. And so apparently with uh, certain activities with mechanical shear forces, they can have hemorrhage into Hoffa's fat pad, and then they get an inflammatory response and swelling of Hoffa's fat pad, and then when it's swollen, it's more susceptible to further impingement. And this is a case where they have bright strands of fluid signal throughout Hoffa's fat pad. Typically, Hoffa's fat pad is very uniform and dark uh, on this fat suppressed sequence. And sometimes you can see a little linear band of brightness coming down. And a really fine band is not a big deal. That's a little bit of fluid tracking along the course of the infrapatellar ligament or the ligamentum mucosum, but this diffuse patchy edema is abnormal. And this is something I don't see very often. More commonly, I'll see inflammation near the top, right beneath the patella. Patients who have patellar tracking disorders can impinge fat in the superior lateral margin, but this is a different entity. It's just diffuse inflammation throughout the Hoffa's fat pad, and again, we call this Hoffa disease. And of course, there's another one up here I talked about in another video, this little triangle. This is the quadriceps fat pad, and this is nice, normal fatty signal. And this is another uh, place that can be impinged and become inflamed. Anyway, thank you very much.